Right, are we all ready for our walk, Rob? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> right, we've parked no, the car. No, that's it. We've parked the car where we normally come off the coast path at Nos Mayo. We're now about to walk about four miles down the lanes to Mothercombe and then follow the coast path back. Should be a good day. The weather's glorious. Isn't that right, Rob? It is. It is. It is. Right, let's go. And as we start our walk to Mothercombe, this is what we've got for the next uh, four or five miles. It takes about an hour and a half to get before we can even start walking on the coast path. Uh, our lovely favourite, hedgerow walks. We love these, don't we, Rob? We sure do. We, do. we sure do. On the plus side for, for Ben and Leslie, it is flat. A very windy view over the valleys. Absolutely gorgeous. Let's get back to that way. schoolhouse for a coffee okay after our five mile hour and a half walk down the lanes we've finally come to the beautiful mother Bay. the tides in when it's out for those that have never been here before that is one big beach and you can actually walk across to the slipway over there but now we've finally got the start of the coast path off we go steps steps lots of steps lots of steps going down we're down the steps where we started up there and now we've got all these down there I'm not sure which is worse going up or down but eventually we'll get to that bay over there Knackered after that hill, mate. No, let's get cracking. Beautiful, isn't it? Look at the difference of that sea to the other day when there was no wind. I'm going to catch many kayakers out, kayakers out there today. And Rob have been trying desperately to remember the name of Roger, the guy that did the travel shows in the 60s, the documentaries. Rob, Alan you've Whitaker. just remembered what his name is. What is it? Alan Whitaker. So Roger's name is Alan Whitaker. <laughs> You'd think with 139 years between us that one of us would have a brain cell, a memory cell, wouldn't you? I don't mind you, mind you, and black and brain cells probably works as well. I've got one brain cell, it's only worth having one left. This is our view. 
view as we stop for lunch. It's a horrible view. Can't bear to look at it. There you are. I don't remember that hill last time I did this. I think they piled some dirt on the road to make a new hill. Uh, quite a steep bit, wasn't it? Yeah. Bring Ben on that You've one. That. Ben would love that. Oh, great. Ben would hate it if we brought it up there, wouldn't she? Oh, she'd, she'd break her legs. She might do something. <laughs> she'd break her legs if we made her walk up there. Oh. Still, the view's worth it. We've done. That is the steepest, mate. This is the first bench we've seen all day. And I think we should have a five minute sit down after that. Wow, wow. We may have had to climb that hill all the way from down there. But look at that view. Beautiful, isn't it? Nice to be in a bit of uh, woodland, actually, isn't it? Out the wind. Now, if we look there, there's Burg Island. So just before that, that bay's mother come by. So we've walked all the way around there, up and down those little bays. Crack it all, isn't it, Rob? Nearly there. Nearly there. Around the corner, hopefully, then we're nearly back to the car. What a day! Beautiful. Close up some sheep. Good job I turned around when I did, I nearly walked in a big cow pat. Hopefully, mate, when we come over the top of this, we'll see that, I think it's called Warren House Place. Distance 11 miles. The current time is 3.30. 
We're there. <laughs> More heavy breathing. Heavy breathing. And the car. Hey! <laughs> the car. We made it back to the car. Wow. That was a cracking walk. Enjoy that, mate. I tell you what, I'm knackered after those hills. Wow. Here we go.